What is going on guys? My name is Ron back again from Moment Views here with another episode reaction to ReZero. This is going to be episode 3 of the second season and as you can see from the very beginning, haven't even started it, it's at 0, 0.00 seconds in. Uh, we are getting right into the action, no little flair, no intro whatsoever well, yet. Um, but we are going to be getting more details and more of an introduction to The Witch of Greed. Now, The Witch of Greed was introduced in the very beginning from the very first promo um but i heard that was just more of like a flare it wasn't really can canonical um but it was just more of a like hey this is what's going on uh and so i'm really curious to see what's going to happen not gonna lie she kind of waifu material i know she might be batshit crazy and you know the rule you know the one swear the one rule don't stick your dick in crazy but she's 2D, so therefore it, it, it it's it's okay. Um, but yeah, I might have to bring out the very famed and notorious Nuts Button. Who knows? We'll see what happens. But anyways, guys, I'm ready to jump into this episode. So guys, without further ado, let's jump in to the third episode of the second season of ReZero, starting in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. Echidna. That she's a witch. Intro. Intro? Intro. Oh, intro! Man, don't you hate when you boot up Windows and you see this shit? <laughs> so it's all in his head. I am curious what she's playing. Yeah. That's true. And it's not like he can, it's not like it, he's afraid, of, well, I mean, he's afraid of death, but yeah. <laughs> She is pretty. Really? They're having this weird normal conversation. Well, you know what I mean. Hmm. Are you single? And are you ready to mingle? So there's... M Wait, what?
Was there something in that tea? There was. Resistance. Are you single? <laughs> I don't care. Fuck it. <laughs> Intriguing. Hmm. physically touching her. But I mean, it's protected by something. <laughs> Damn, I'm just... Shutting the door in her. She just wants someone to talk to. I volunteer as tribute. I'm right here. Hey, girl. Compensation. Blood. Marriage vows, I got you. Is it the same thing if he... If he talks about it, will he die? I knew I was going to have to use this, this but I knew I was going to have to use the button at one point. I do like her personality though, not going to lie. She has this like demeanor about her. I I I thoroughly enjoy her so far. But yeah, and now I'm curious like, how, does she get to call him at will? I don't know. And what happened to them? Yeah, Amelia Noto. I just even remember. Oh my god, I can't believe Otto's fucking dead. Oh, he was in the trailer. I've only seen the trailer once, but... Hey, good job. Who's this guy? Is that her brother? Is that her brother, the maid? I think they gotta be, like, unconscious or something. Damn! Did you just German suplex a fucking... Damn. 
I think that's like her brother, though. The maid's the maid's brother. I mean, they look extremely similar. Huh. Oh, that's right. That's Garfield? I'm calling him Garfield. Yeah, just slightly jump in the gun, just slightly. Ganglion. Not devil. You don't insult my waifu? <laughs> 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 Garfield Garfield Every time I see Garfield I think of Car Garfield the cat I don't know if it, like he's known outside of the United States And he took it off, yeah. Which is what he's wearing right now. Mm. Okay, yeah, because they said that she was saying something like, like they were talking about like um, Beatrice was talking about how they're like mixed beast beast. Yeah, you would think. What's up, Ram? It's been a minute. It's been a minute since I've seen you. So where's Roswell? I know. Oh, so this is going to be the episode where they had to break the news, sir. Garfield. <laughs> Cabby. Cabbage. Because <laughs> Otto's like the punching bag of this. <laughs> it's pretty, uh, it's pretty like, oh, complimentation, yeah. All you gotta do is compliment him and, he, and he's, he's easy. Oh, that's right. Yeah, this is gonna, he's gonna have to say something.
It's probably you should probably have this in closed doors. Amelia knows. Amelia knows. This is definitely a, a conversation they should have behind closed doors. Especially Roswell should also talk about it. Uh, they should also talk about it to Roswell. I know it's going to take a little bit for me to agree that Amelia is best girl, but everyone says that this is going to be the season that at least establishes it. So I shall see with my own eyes. There he is. What's up, Michael Jackson? Inside joke. Damn, what happened to you? Yeah, Roswell was like some powerful ass magician. I'm guessing it's mostly just to protect um, halflings. Ah. It's because she's dead. He's like, huh, that name sounds familiar. I wonder what that little interaction was. Mixed blood. Can they not leave? They're stuck? To get fucked up. Huh. 
Huh. Interesting. Very interesting. <laughs> Way to ring down the mood really quickly. The ones that they shun that they shunned her, I believed. It's been a minute since I watched the first season. It's just because she's a nice person. They don't want to hear ulterior motives. That's yeah. I wonder how this episode's going to end. We're near the end. Coming up soon. Looking at my recording time. With this kind of show, I kind of feel like it, there is no way it's going to end. Like It's going to end on a, cliff, a cliffhanger. It, 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 it's 3-0. What do you expect? I mean, it doesn't have to be like something really bad. It just... It, the show always likes to end on a cliff hang, cliffhanger. He still needs to talk to her about Ram. Rem. He still needs to talk to Ram about Rem. Is that Puck? No. For a split second, I was like, uh, I know. Okay, I see credits. What's how's it gonna end? How's it gonna end? <laughs> Oh, what's going to happen? What's going to happen, guys? I don't know. I don't know. Here. 
So he's been rejected. No, he, aren't you like not supposed to go in? Oh, he's been accepted too? Wait, what? All right, so what's gonna end? How's this gonna end? He's no f what? He's back. One, your dad is ripped as fuck, but... Whoa! Wait, 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 wait. He's... What? <laughs> oh, shit. I mean, they said he's gonna relieve... He needs to relive his past, but... Oh, fuck, what's the trial? Like, is it like... Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, I'm curious. I'm really curious. I have no idea how this is going to turn out. Oh, this is going to be good. All right, so he went back. Obviously, he went back. I'm wondering if he still has his memories. Um, I want that. Okay, per my, my, my prediction again. I've never, I've, I've never seen anything. Don't know. It's two ways this is going to happen. So he's now back in his original world with either the same memories or replacement or um memories where he just kind of like is temporarily just com like temporarily forgot everything that's happened since then um and if that is the case where it's like his memories are gone temporarily he would need to eventually come to the conclusion that where he's at is not where he's meant to be i guess or if he has his memories and he now realizes, oh, fuck, I'm back in the original world. I'm back in my own world. Um, is he going to need, does he need to find a way to get out? Or he needs to, or maybe it's a test to see like, hey, maybe this life back where you were is better. And if he follows that path, he fails the trial. I don't know. There's a lot of questions, but... It basically mind fucks you and be like, oh yeah, go, let's go to your past. So that's what Amelia's probably doing. She's reliving her past at a certain memory, which we'll probably see in the next episode, maybe. Who knows? I, I don't fucking know what's going on. I love it, though. <sighs> that was really good. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna go wrap up this video. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. Ooh, this is gonna get good. This is getting good. I knew this was gonna end off cliffhanger because it's fucking ReZero. ReZero's like, hey, hey, happy ending, right? Everything's all peaches and cream. Ha <laughs> ha. Fuck you. No, it's not. But yeah, I'm really curious to see what's going to happen next. Oh, but anyways, guys, I'm going to go wrap this video up. It's been going on for a little bit too long because I'm going to go watch Decadence next. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode reaction. Let me know what you guys saw in the comment section below. Keep it civil. Keep it dis keep discussing things. Keep the spoilers out of there, though. I know you, I know you guys are actually really great about that. And Awesome. Kudos to you guys. You guys are great. I do read almost all of your comments. Um, in fact, I do read every comment, but I tend to like see like if I get to get a little sniff that it's a spoiler or something about this uh, the series and I don't know anything about it, I, I usually am able to filter that out. But uh, but you guys just seem to be really good at not posting spoilers. So thank you guys so much. Um, usually, if you guys post anything about the story that I don't know, it's mostly just you explaining things more in detail about what's going on without really spoiling things in the future things, which is great. Anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully, you guys enjoy this episode reaction, and I will see you guys in the next video. See ya.